so as you can tell we have both of the exhaust tips off of the vehicle and like I said these exhaust tips aren't small these are four inches but when you compare it to the five inches it is a noticeable difference and if you don't think that this is a big difference go ahead and ask your wife I'm pretty sure she can agree with what I'm saying What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. My name is Eric and in today's video we're going to be working on the scat pack and actually we're taking off right where I left off the last video on the scat pack. If you guys did see that video I did install a rear diffuser. If you guys have not seen it go ahead and check that video out as well. Now when I was looking for diffusers for this vehicle I did see a lot of pictures of the vehicle with the diffuser and uh, something that I kind of didn't like was the fact that it made the exhaust tips look a lot smaller than they really are. So in today's video what I'm gonna do is install 5 inch exhaust tips on the Dodge Charger. The stock exhaust tip on this vehicle is a 4 inch exhaust tip and that is not small but it does look small now that I've installed a rear diffuser and uh, I personally do not like that so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and fix that by installing 5 inch exhaust tips. So yeah these are the 5 inch exhaust tips for the scat pack. Uh, these guys are massive your whole fist fits in there don't want to get demonetized but kind of just want to show you guys how big they are um, and I did get all black just so that I can kind of go with the theme of the vehicle um, so I think they're gonna look a lot nicer and it's gonna fill up that hole in the exhaust so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, remove the stock exhaust tips and install these bad boys on here and uh, the tools that you're gonna need for this job um, are basically a ratchet a 13 millimeter socket and you're also going to need a hammer to kind of pry that guy off um, because it's going to be a little bit stuck on there now for this job you actually do not need to lift up the vehicle that is overkill the only thing you need to do like I said is get a 13 millimeter socket and uh, go ahead and get a ratchet and remove this fastener but should be pretty easy and straightforward there we go as you guys can see that bolt right there is just loose and uh, what you want to do here is just kind of wiggle the exhaust tip and uh, it's going to break it apart uh, from the exhaust uh, muffler right there. What you can do like I said is get a hammer, kind of tap it a little bit and break the rust or corrosion that's kind of holding it in place. There we go. And I'll go ahead and do this side as well. So as you can tell we have both of the exhaust tips off of the vehicle. And like I said these exhaust tips aren't small. These are 4 inches. But when you compare it to the 5 inches it is a noticeable difference and if you don't think that this is a big difference go ahead and ask your wife I'm pretty sure she can agree with what I'm saying. So to install the 5 inch exhaust tip you're doing the opposite of what you did to remove your stock one. This just basically fits like OEM. I'm going to go ahead and put both of them on and then we're going to see how it looks. Uh, a lot of people say that this gives you a louder exhaust sound. But I'm not going to lie to you guys, I don't expect any changes in the exhaust sound or tone. This is just an exhaust tip. It's not really doing anything other than cosmetically making the vehicle look nicer. When you install the exhaust tip onto the vehicle, you are going to notice some resistance, but that's normal. Uh, you just want to go ahead and push far inside the clamp to make sure that it's on there securely.
before you fasten down the clamp make sure that you have the fitment how you want it I want to show the carbon exhaust logo uh, so I'm gonna make sure that both of them look the same and then all you got to do at that point is just fasten down the fastener and tighten up the clamp make sure that this is done right because you don't want the exhaust tip to fall off um, if you don't install it right that can happen so I'm gonna go ahead and take my time and get this right and then I'm gonna show you guys how it looks so there you guys have it I have the 5 inch exhaust tips on the charger and uh, I think it looks a lot better compared to the stock 4 inch exhaust tips one hour later alright guys so I am back in the garage and um, I will say that the exhaust tips look a lot better in black in my opinion uh, kind of just flows with the vehicle I have white on black or black on white um, so it, they look pretty nice now there is different options there's like the chrome stainless steel look and the black one that I have which is like a ceramic coated uh, paint on the exhaust tips so they should last a long time uh, there is one thing that I kind of don't like about the exhaust tips and uh, that is that you can't really adjust the distance that they poke out of the diffuser I kind of would have wished that they were a little bit longer so that the exhaust tip extends past the diffuser I have a fear that if you know I leave them like that it's gonna eventually make a hole in the diffuser because it's very close and uh, that's the reason you're doing this you're basically want to fill in that gap but I feel like the exhaust fumes are kind of hitting the diffuser a little bit so um, I'm gonna keep an eye on that um, to see if it gets damaged uh, aside from that the construction of the exhaust tips are great they feel better than the OEM uh, exhaust tips that the vehicle comes with um, and overall for 200 bucks I think it's a pretty good deal if you go to an exhaust shop I think you would probably spend around the same uh, trying to get some custom exhaust tips the only benefit to that would be that you can extend the exhaust tips past the diffuser so that might be a good option for you guys so that you don't run into an issue like how I'm having in my setup if you guys did find this video entertaining and useful don't forget to give the video a thumbs up consider subscribing for more uh, scat pack uh, videos and I'll see you guys all in the next one